Find our seats. There we go. All right. Ex are you excited to see all of our little babies? Even though some of them aren't so little anymore. And they're definitely past the cute baby stage, at least mine is, into the terrible toddler stage. All right, yeah. Well, let me go through some announcements, and then we will get on with the show there. Uh, tonight, we've got our power-up groups in uh, Bloomfield and Atumwa. Make sure you get into one of those and enjoy a season of just being able to share life together. Uh, share your struggles, your burdens, your celebrations. All these kinds of things happen in these places, and great Bible study does happen as well. But we would love to have you be a part of one of those. Talk to Bo or Marcy or myself, and we'll get you hooked in. We'd love to have you guys start coming to our uh, Power Up Life groups on Sunday nights. Tomorrow night is our men's Bible study, and uh, during the month of June, we have teenagers that are cooking uh, dinner for us every Monday night uh, as a fundraiser for them going to camp. Last week, they made a delicious batch of spaghetti, and uh, they're going to cook something else for us tomorrow night. Excited about that. So men, tacos? Oh, my goodness. Men, come have some tacos tomorrow night, 6 o'clock. It's a good time. Uh, Tuesday, we have our prayer walk starting the West Hospital parking lot at 6.30. So make sure you are there for that. Wednesday night, we have our regular stuff. Friday night, right here in the sanctuary, we're going to show the movie War Room. Uh, great movie. Uh, so if you just need a night out, um, come and have a good time. We'll have some popcorn and drinks and just show that movie right here at 7 o'clock. June 22nd, I want to ask you to come to our church work day. Uh, it's going to be a great day, um, and uh, we just got a lot of stuff that needs to get done, and we'd love to have your help in getting that done. And then you can see all the other stuff coming up July 4th, the actual day of July 4th. We will have a food and fireworks fun night, uh, just good time all around there, and then all the other stuff coming up. All right, that's it for announcements, I think. Is that good? All right, I'm going to turn it over to Marcy and Jennifer, and they're going to tell us about babies. All right. Okay. Um, before we start, I just wanted to to say that um, I just, God laid it on my heart just that we just had graduation, a graduation ceremony, or the, the graduation um, Sunday, and then the, now the baby day, and like, I just think about what other people that have come to this church for so long, and and how long that they prayed for kids, and I think how blessed we are to have so many kids, and not just the graduates, and not just the babies, but we have a ton of kids that come on care in the nights at caravans, and I just want to encourage you as adults in the church that we just continue to pray over these kids, like all the time, the babies on, up, and through, and just continue to con pray for them. So I'm going to turn it over to Jennifer real quick. All right, we're so excited to have these kids in here. They're three and under, and the first ones we have coming down are Hallie and Parker. They are 17 months. <laughs> Hallie's nickname is Halibear, and Parker's nickname is Monkey. Their favorite food is Cheerios. They, um, Hallie's favorite toy is a dog from Coco, and Parker's is a toy phone. They both love the water table. Favorite hobby, they love being read to, and their favorite animals are dog and cows. And any embarrassing moments, not yet, so everybody be uh, thinking about embarrassing moments for them. Um, when they found out they were having the kids, uh, they were excited and been then very shocked when they found out they were having twins. And the scariest moment they had was they just found out about um, them having allergies. So be praying for them that they can get that all figured out. So Hallie and Parker, go, 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 go. <laughs> all right. And I know that you guys are super excited about the balls. You're welcome. <laughs> and the balloons. You're welcome. <laughs> all right. Next we have Autumn. Come on down, Autumn. She is. She was born July 2017. 
Her nicknames are Monkey, Small Fry, and Punky. Uh, her favorite food is spaghetti or whatever nobody else wants to eat. <laughs> favorite toys are balls. So congratulations on your excess amount of balls here. Yeah. Um, favorite hobby, playing with Donkey and being outside. She loves all animals, um, especially her Sharpe. And her reaction, uh, mom's reaction upon finding out she was having a baby was she was very surprised. And her scariest moment was she flipped over on toy cement, on, flipped over a toy on cement, right? That's funny. So that's Autumn. <laughs> All right, Miss Alice is going to ride down, I think. <laughs> nope, she's going to run down. <laughs> All right. Alice was born in June of 2016. She's two. Her nicknames are Sis uh, or Monkey. Um, her favorite food, she says, is sandwich, hamburger, and yogurt. Ogurt or yogurt. And her favorite toy is a microphone or a jumpoline. Her favorite color is <laughs> elbow pink. Uh, pink or yellow, as mom says. She, her favorite hobby is she plays with Destiny. That's her favorite thing to do. Uh, she loves to dance, and she says she loves to spend time with Matthew. Is that right? Mamma. Sorry, it says Mamma. <laughs> Matthew, same thing. <laughs> uh, her favorite animal, she says, are monkeys. Uh, she, wants, she, wants, she wants to be a doctor when she grows up, and she wants to go to school at low... Wherever doctors go, she says, where doctors go. And in reaction upon finding out she was uh, that mom was pregnant, was she was scared, then re really excited. So that's Alice for you. <laughs> very pretty. They've all been very concerned about these balls. When am I going to get the balls? Okay, Mr. Jake. Come on down, Jake. Jake was born. He's three and a half. He's born September 11th. He walked down so nicely. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah. Uh, so nicknames, Daddy says, so the child, I did child answers and then parent answers. He says, Daddy calls me Jacob. Mommy calls me sweetheart. <laughs> parent says, Jake, you're the kid or bug. Um, favorite food, he says he wants chips. He likes chips. And his mom says meat or chips. Uh, Paw Patrol is his favorite toy. His, fa <laughs> his favorite color is green. His favorite hobby, he says, is go to church and play. Uh, mom and dad say swing swimming or throwing rocks in the lake. Favorite animal is dog and cat. Uh, what do you want to be when you grow up? Jake says he wants to be a policeman who works at the police station. And parents say fi said fireman. Says, where do you want to go to school? At my GG school. Uh, any embarrassing moments from parents? It says ordering food at the counter, and they turned around, and Jake was gone, and they found him with a teen, a bunch of teens sitting at a table having conversation. So <laughs> he's preparing himself. Okay. Those would have been good too. Okay. Uh, reaction upon finding out you were having a baby, they were very surprised. Scariest moment, and I know a lot of you guys remember this, was when he swallowed a battery. So that was pretty scary for everybody. So these are all of our babies. If you can give them all a round of applause. <laughs> so chasing them around. And Pastor RJ is going to pray over them. Okay. All right. It is so awesome to have. Uh, multiple babies uh, in the church. Um, I heard one time if 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 uh, there's if the sanctuary ain't crying, your church is dying. So we ain't we're not we're not sad when when we hear babies are upset when we hear babies screaming and crying in church. That means we've got life, right? That's uh, a good thing. So we're we're happy to have all of these babies here and all the families represented here. We've got extended families, grandparents. Uh, cousins, all kinds of stuff going on, and it's just such a great sign of, of what God is doing in our church, and so I'm grateful for that. Let me pray for all of these, all of these kids uh, and their parents very much right now. Heavenly Father, we thank you so much. 
We thank you that you have given us joy uh, in watching these kids and, and those of us that have been fortunate enough to, to call these kids our own. Father God, I just, I'm so grateful. Uh, and I just pray that as uh, these kids continue to grow, that they would find themselves in you, that they would find who they are through you, Father God, and that this church would be a place where they could learn about you and see love in everything that they watch and as they grow, experience that love themselves, Father God. And I just thank you for their parents and their grandparents, uh, that, that as they have shown uh, a desire to follow Jesus themselves, that that is an example that these kids will follow as well. Thank you, Father God. Bless these families and bless these children. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. All right. Yeah, I mean, you guys, if we want to do like Dodger Stadium beach ball action, you know, with the, with the balls through the sermon, I'd be okay with that. But uh, otherwise, you might want to go ahead and put them in the back. That might be best. But, uh, yeah, you can put all of them in the nursery. I bet Jacob would like that. <laughs> Good job, guys. Good job.